Warning, the following video contains jokes and people who don't get jokes. So, <laughs> be warned. Hey guys, Kobe95 here. Some big YouTuber named Candino is like 100,000 subscribers or something. He made this video exposing fake speedruns. And one of the speedruns he used was my fake speedrun. And the thing is, it's not like it was meant to be portrayed as real. It was meant to be a joke. And it's mediocre. Like, I make that very clear. But he says that it's not a troll. And, uh, yeah. This video was brought to my attention when Chris sent it to me in the middle of the night. Chris was also the other guy on the call in the original speedrun, which makes it even more hilarious and fitting. So, yeah. Onwards with the video. My future a bit of my friend Lance, too. He was really upset about this, even more than me. <laughs> Welcome to Cool Kid 95. I hope you enjoy your stay. Final speedrun comes from Cool Kid 95, and with this one, I don't actually think it was a troll. I'm pretty sure this is just a young kid who has no idea what the official rules are, but nevertheless, it's a really funny speedrun. Okay, so first and most importantly, he says that it wasn't a troll. It was a troll. It was literally a joke. The whole point is that it was satire. I mean, like, look at the title. It's like Cool Kid 95's. To definitely not fake and mediocre speedrun. If like, anything, this it's, guy it's is fake. the guy that's the fraud here. Yeah, exactly. He's the one that's the fraud. He also misspelled my name like most people do. But he did a better job because he still did correct capitalization. He just <coughs> didn't add the space. So I guess I, I can forgive him for that. It's still better than my actual fans do. No offense to people like, you know, a you Moose Master. He says that I'm just a young kid who doesn't know the rules. I don't know if you'd call me a young kid. I was 15 when I made that. That's, that's up to you to interpret. But don't know the rules? Yeah, I don't know the speedrun rules. That doesn't matter. It's a joke. That's irrelevant. But he acts like it is kind of relevant because, yeah. you know, it's definitely real. Like this, like, can you not take, like, can somebody not take a joke? So Cool Kid begins his speedrun, and so far it looks pretty normal, besides the fact that he immediately changes the game mode to survival once it was created before. Mm, yes, that's the only suspicious thing about it. Not the fact that my chat is filled with advancements. Not the fact that there's a pre that a pre-placed bed. No, that's not suspicious. What's suspicious is that I switched to game modes. Which is still suspicious, but that's not the most suspicious thing there. He goes ahead and tries to mine some trees, and then he breaks the starting chest, which happens to contain a lot of netherite armor. That's crazy lucky. Oh my gosh, it even has an insane apple. Now, at this point, he decides to go and actually starts mining down at a random spot and finds a shulker box with all the items he would ever need to complete a speedrun in one shulker box at a random location. That's that's crazy. There's a chest that has everything I'll possibly need. And yeah, I even say that in the video. And of course I'm doing my dark shill clickbait voice, but not deepened. And yeah, I point that out. And I'm like, yeah, let me just dig out inconspicuously. Like, I'm making it clear that I obviously know there's something down there. Like, it's a joke. I'm trying to twist my content! So once he gets all of his stuff from the shulker box, I assume he's trying to go along and find his nether portal or something similar to that, but with all of his items, he ends up finding a random end portal conveniently located right next to where he spawned. It says that he assumes that I'm going to look for my uh, nether portal when, what? Look for nether portal? I, I don't think that's how they do it. They go look and build one, they, they like the water and lava trick. But that's not what I'm doing. He even shows the clip where I'm where I'm like hitting in the distance at the air to where the ruined end portal is. And he's like, found a random lit end portal. It's like, no, it's a joke. It's a ruined end portal. It's a it's it's a joke. I even make a joke about it. Saying it was added in excuse me, snapshot twenty W fifty two A on the date of February thirtieth, twenty twenty. Like, none of it makes sense. That's the whole fucking point. It's a joke. So he jumps in the end portal, and at two minutes, he's already in the end, which is crazy, on world record pace. So I'm going to put a time lapse here, but he takes forever to mine up to get to the actual area where you can fight the dragon. But once he finally does, he opens up to the dragon, and he begins his fight. He starts off by taking an enchanted gold apple and starts to fight this enderman, which is really completely useless in this part of the speedrun, and he starts to run towards where the dragon is. But miraculously, he finds another random shulker box. That's not a shulker box. 
shulker box. That's a shulker. I mean, I know it's a minor little mistake, but like, still, it's not another shulker box. It's an actual shulker. That's the point. It hits me with levitation so I can go up the thing. It's what I used in that old Minecraft map that I never got to finish because my old phone broke. It's a concept that I like. She then fights and takes another enchanted golden apple because, well, of course, he has 64. He has plenty to spare. So, after he flies up, he tries to make it to the top, but it appears that he is having a little bit of trouble. I don't think this guy is necessarily the best. No, I'm not necessarily the best. I have a lot of trouble at Minecraft when I uh, get swarmed and stuff. It's why I always play peaceful. But sometimes peaceful isn't fun enough, but that's not the point. The point is, yeah, I'm not the best player. And I'm not a professional speedrunner, or a speedrunner at all by any means. It's a joke. But he starts to break all the crystals, and he sees the dragon flying around, so he tries to fall back down, but the dragon starts hitting him off, and he literally dies! He doesn't even complete the speedrun! <laughs> This guy just does the speedrun, and just like that, the speedrun completely is over. That's not true. I do finish the speedrun, and I don't stop there. That death is not even 7 minutes in out of the total 25 minutes. I can prove to you that I keep uh, playing the, the, the speedrun after that death. Roll the clip. What? <laughs> no, 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 no. Death? No, no, no. I, I, I survived. That was just a new feature called a, a, a fake dying. Yes, I hit that like subscribe button. I forgot to say. Now I remember to say. Oh my gosh. Let me, let me just turn down the difficulty. Uh, uh, not peaceful's too much. Uh, yes, yes, this is better. So this guy submits a speedrun, doesn't even kill the ender dragon, even after he attempts to get all the items in the game, and still fails. Both of those things are lies. I never submitted to speedrun because it was never supposed to, you know, be real, or even a troll to the people there. It's just like a f silly funny joke on YouTube. And it got a lot more views and dislikes than I thought because people couldn't tell it was a joke. I guess this guy is another one. But I can hope that he's smart enough and he's just lying. Which is still bad, but I mean... At least he's not stupid. We don't- I don't want to believe he's stupid. And also, um, I did kill the Ender Dragon. And I can show you that as well. I didn't do it legitimately, of course, but I still killed the Ender Dragon. Oh, uh, God. It's like immune to my effects. I'll defeat that dragon. Oh, yeah? Let me use the most powerful command I have. I mean, which- I, I accidentally killed myself. Where is that dragon? Didn't want to live in the same world as Ender Dragon. I mean, I want to live in the same world as, as the Ender Dragon. I mean, I just don't want to be the Ender Dragon's friend. I have to slay her so I can get- so I can get money and views and fame and- and, and bitches because I don't because I because I because I objectify women because that's what the cool kids do. Remember, kids, gender what? equality okay. is bad. Hey. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? I'm I'm trying to be a joke. Come on, this is all for the all for the fun of the of the of the of the, of the parody video. Act like oh, annoying. Bye. Oh my gosh, guys, I did it. Where's the dragon's corpse, though? I'm pretty sure this was made by a young kid probably who didn't fully understand the rules and you can tell that he wasn't the best player skillfully But that was still a really funny run and that's gonna wrap up the last speed run All right, once again Me being a young kid that's up for debate. That's your opinion. And yeah, I don't really know the rules of the speed run again, but like yeah like, uh, yeah, he was presenting my speedrun in a false way and lying about it. And if you want to watch the whole speedrun, I'll have it uh, linked in the end or something. So, yeah, go in check the out the original if you... Check it out in the description. I don't, I, maybe I'll put it in the end screen, too. Well, I don't really know. But, yeah, go check out the original video. And, uh, yeah, I guess you can also subscribe Moose Mas to Moose Master because I mentioned him, too. But, uh, yeah. But also... Make sure to like and subscribe and share yeah, and uh, subscribe. I already said subscribe, you know, blah, blah, blah. All that, but, uh, yeah. See you all next time. Goodbye. Good content.